Hey everybody, what is going on? Pete Simonetti here with a new series just for you guys. As you see right down here, Pinstripe Prospect Weekly. What this is going to be is I am going to highlight and cover. Actually, matter of fact, I am going to cover, not highlight, because you all will be choosing which prospect I talk about next. In the comments below, after this video, since this is the first one, I went ahead and, and I chose a guy. I chose Oswald Peraza, who you guys have heard a lot about this year. And I chose Oswald Peraza because he is getting a lot of hype and I hear a lot of good things about him and I want to chat about him. And then I said, boom, look at this beautiful idea. Pinstripe Prospect Weekly. Remember, guys, I'll remind you again at the end, but go in the comments section below and let me know who you want me to talk about next. So here we are, Oswald Peraza getting a ton of recognition out there, really because he's putting in the work. He's doing a tremendous job. So let's go back. Peraza is 21 years old. He was signed out of Venezuela for $175,000 back in 2016. Already on the 40-man roster. That, that tells you immediately what the Yankees think about this young man. And, and everything I hear is bonkers. This kid is really, really good. So on the 20 and 80 scale, which gives you an idea on a scouting front of where a guy projects to possibly be. So anything really above your 40s is, is is midway. Anything above that is is a well above average prospect, right? 50s and up are phenomenal. 60s are terrific, right? On the on that scale from 20 to 80, Peraza is a 55 on a hit, 45 on a power, 60 on the run, 60 on the arm, 60 as a fielder, comes to a 55 overall. He is the top infield prospect for the New York Yankees, okay? So that is big. And let's take a look at what Oswald is doing so far this year in triple A, in double A, sorry, single A, and now in double A with Somerset. Oswald Peraza in a high A ball hit 306, five homers. Overall, he was 34 for 111 before he got his promotion. And, you know, in, in A-ball, you started to hear how phenomenal this guy is and how good he really could be. Where is that level at? You know, um, how high can he go and how quick can he go? I was talking to Team NYY News the other day about Peraza and how many people tell me so many good things about him and, and where his ceiling is and, and what the next steps could be. There's even rumors early on that if he continues up hitting the way he is now in double-A, got into a little slump there, but picked it up again, there could be a chance this guy could reach triple-A by the end of this year, which is absolutely phenomenal. That'll be a three-level season um, for a guy that's only 21. So really, really good there. Um, so far, as we said before, in double-A, he is now up to 284, three home runs. He is, tw he is 29 for 102 overall, 21 runs scored. Again, overall, 21 stolen bases this year. As I explained before on that scale, this is a guy who everybody believes has plus speed, a plus arm, solid defender, and is a legitimate shortstop. They really think this guy will stay as a shortstop, could also go to second base, potentially third because he has an absolute rocket for an arm. But the one thing that a lot of people talk about Peraza is he has high IQ of the game. So he pays attention very well. He knows what to do. He's very, very smooth. That is something you hear about a lot when it comes to his fielding. He has legitimate stolen base speed that he is going to be able to steal 10, 15, 20 plus bases a year. 15 to 20 home runs is the ceiling. They believe that's where it'll be. Could always be higher than that. And he's a guy who can definitely hit for average. So Oswald Peraza is a guy you you want around for the long the long period. And we know the Yankee season right now could dictate the type of moves they make. I speak to many evaluators, spoke to one today that gave me some information on the deadline and things that could be coming up for the Yankees. And one of the names you hear about a lot when it comes to teams is Oswald Peraza. He's going to be a hot ticket. He's going to be a hot ticket because remember, every other team that does advanced scouting, they see a guy like this. They see the tools he has. They see the makeup he has. And they want him on a club. Who wouldn't? These, this is the type of guy you want in your system. He is that good. So looking at a possible projection going forward when it comes to the New York Yankees, 
either Peraza has a shot of being dealt to get a, a, a top line guy. We're not going to speculate here on that video who that guy could be, but there's names out there. We know the names out there. Could also be in the offseason. If the Yankees really look to retool and maybe some of these guys got to go to get some of the guys they want, um, that's always a possibility. But one of the things for the Yankees is he makes the idea of a potential Glaber Torres deal a little more comforting knowing he's on his way. And he's there. Knowing he's on his way really helps the Yankees to, to maybe to maybe limit the reaction from a fan base perspective if they did make that move. He's undoubtedly lined up right now where he is to be a starter somewhere, whether that is with the Yankees or elsewhere. I personally am a big fan of this guy. Speak very highly also of other Yankee prospects, but he's one of the guys where I'm like, man, if if you're giving him up, do not miss. Do not miss. So, folks, that sums up Oswald Peraza. Simonetti, major fan, major, major thumbs up for me. This is a guy I look to hold on to unless you do not miss on if you do trade him and get him from somebody else. This is a guy rising through the system. I am a huge Oswald Peraza fan. You guys let me know a couple of things in the comments below. One, are you a fan of Peraza? Have you followed him? Have you seen him live? Tell me a little about him. What do you think about him? And also, who do you want me to talk about next on Pinstripe Prospect Weekly? Again, this is yours truly, Pizza Minetti, for the one, the only, NYY News. Yeah,